Hello friends, are you ready for some freaky, spooky paranormal videos? Today we are checking out Nukes Top 5. If you decide when you look at this video that you like it, please leave a like and subscribe and comment down below if you do and I will thank you personally. Now without further ado, check out the spooky videos. River's Edge. Cambodian Paranormal Investigation Team RC Fun TV2 travels to an allegedly haunted area along the bank of a river. The locals tell stories of many horrible incidents that have taken place in this small area, right at the river's edge. First, it is said that a young boy was swept away in a mudslide in this area, and sadly, he perished in the flood. Oh. Another tale that's recounts sad. that a man took his own life at the river's edge. And then, even more tragedy, because and the graves to be of several children can be found here, buried along the river bank. Because this spot has such a horrible history, the RC Fun- No wonder this place is haunted, yeah? <laughs> With all this death around? TV team decides to leave offerings and prayers for any distressed spirits that might be unable to move on to the other side. And not long after leaving their offerings, the paranormal investigators spot something truly terrifying. Let's check it out. Hello? Hello? Who the F is that? What the F? What? He just dove into the water, the man. investigators spot what appears to be a man sitting on the edge of the river. But something is very off about the mysterious Look at figure. that face. The man is extremely pale and his face is unrecognizable. When the what? team attempts to get closer, the stranger disappears underwater, never to be seen again. Holy toaster, the man. The RC Fun TV team say that they might have just seen the spirit of the man that took his own life yeah. on the riverbank. Or perhaps even the boy that drowned in the flood. But that wasn't a boy, that's a man. Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? Or is it a boy? You I don't know. Decide. Stray away. That's freaky, it's man. It's late in the afternoon when a CCTV camera in the city of Angol, Chile captures a teenage girl presumably walking home from school. What happens next is absolutely chilling. Let's check it out. What? I'm not sure what's going the girl on is here. Walking down a secluded alleyway when a silver Nissan pulls up to the teenager and a man can be seen talking to the girl with a weapon in his hand. The girl is terrified and instinctively walks backward away from the car when the men then back up their car to follow. Well, this video isn't paranormal, but it's still terrifying, man. How your life can change in an instance, you know? You could just be walking home from school. Some, all of a sudden you get kidnapped or killed by some psychos. Life is fragile, man. Or suddenly a little stray dog comes running out of nowhere and aggressively starts barking at the dangerous strangers. The little dog effectively saves the teenage girl from what we can only assume would have been a horrible fate. 
The video Holy about the heroic moly, little dog man. went viral on the internet, with many people giving praise to the stray for recognizing the threat and protecting a complete strain. Give that dog the biggest bone. Danger from harm. Now without a source, I unfortunately don't know what happened to the little dog after it ran out of frame. But as for the footage, it just goes to show again that human beings are always scarier than any ghost or yep, spirit. Definitely. What the F man. Not a helping hand. I'm so happy. Nothing happened to that girl. Holy air fryer man. This next video was posted to Facebook by Marla Teixeira Hernandez from Richmond, California. Marla says that she was rearranging some furniture in her son's bedroom and recorded a video of the room's final look to show to her daughter. But when she watches her video back, she spots something downright chilling. Marla says she was completely alone in the room when what appears to be a little hand can be seen moving behind her uh -huh. son's cabinets. Even creepier, viewers pointed out that a man's voice seems to quietly whisper, don't be afraid to die. What? What? Now, Marla posted the video to Facebook in hopes of getting any thoughts or ideas on what she might have captured. She says that other than one strange incident with a fan switch turning itself off and on in her son's room. Could it have been someone hiding behind? Behind there? I don't think so. She's never really experienced anything paranormal in the house. So what do you think this is? I don't know. Before we move on to the next video, if you see anything that you think should be included in the top five, Contact That's us creepy, at man. at gmail.com. Encounter of the Third Kind. The following is a very old video from the depths of the internet. Source unknown. So, a group of friends are hanging out, drinking and having a good time in the woods of Flacy, France. Party. Suddenly, they spot what they believe to be a dog hiding behind a tree. You saw a thing still? Move it. You, you. Il y a un truc là-bas Il y a un truc derrière là Minou, 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 j'ai trouvé ta mère Putain So dark, I don't see shit Il est mignon le chat Ouais, il est un peu gros le chat, j'aime pas ça Ouais, j'aime barrer Oh, non Bah il y a un... Oh, c'est deux fils de gueule Pourquoi t'as laissé tomber la poche Pour éclairer, putain that's no dog. That ain't no dog. What the F is that face, man? Who the F are you? Something otherworldly can be seen moving around behind the tree. What? Something with long fingers and an unusually large skeletal head. The video abruptly cuts and what happens next? How creepy is that? So could it be that the group had an encounter with an alien? Or a skinwalker? Or just what is that? I don't know. Let me know what, what the F think. is that? It's an alien? The unknown. Skinwalker? Paranormal investigator Alex you tell me from YouTube channel below Hunting the Unknown the sets out to investigate a restaurant in England that's been abandoned for over 20 years. The owners of the restaurant are said to have abruptly fled the property after being tormented by severe paranormal activity. The abandoned and broken down structure is located deep in the middle of the woods, and Alex is all alone as he begins his investigation in the dead of night. After setting up a motion detecting music box in the bar section of the restaurant, Alex already begins to experience strange activity. I've got a music box set up at the moment. Just doing a little walkthrough. Hello? Hello? Hello?
A static camera captures the moment a door slams by itself. But things are about to get even weirder. Let's check it Alex out. Alex decides to do a spirit box session in the hopes of catching some paranormal activity. Where are you? Can you give me a sign, please? Oi, I'm right over here. Oh, Holy. What the f Spatula, man. Alex asks for a sign and bottles sitting on the bar seem to be pushed over on their own. But it's oh. when he takes a closer look at the bottles that he captures something truly disturbing. I just don't understand how these were knocked down. It's crazy, I don't understand this. I'm pretty sure this is like that. Hello? Oh, oh, that was a proper shadow creep. He didn't even see it. Now it was gone. What? Yeah, I saw it too. Who's there? Who the F are you, man? The dark silhouette of a figure can be seen yeah. standing in a room just, right across just from Just staring at him, man. Now, Alex doesn't notice the figure at first, but when he moves towards the door, he realizes that something is not quite right. You're not he alone. He inspects the room to make sure no one is there, but he gets the unsettling feeling that he's being watched. Alex no longer feels safe in the remote building and all by himself. So he decides to just get out of there. You can just watch like this I would. entire investigation and many more spooky videos over on the YouTube channel, Hunting the unknown. I will the check it out. From the cave. Japanese paranormal investigators Gachan, Daichan, and Yasuke are contacted by one of their viewers about a bizarre picture they took in an allegedly haunted cave in Fukuoka Prefecture, Japan. The picture shows what appears to be a woman peeking from a rock inside the caves. Hello? The location is said to be a paranormal hotspot, and many visitors claim to have seen the mysterious apparition of a lady dressed all in white. It's late at night when the clip store team carefully make their way deep underground into the cave system to search for the spot where the photo was taken. <笑><笑><笑> The clip store team manages to find the exact location of the photo. Yeah. But now, with all three members so cramped in such a tiny cave tunnel, Yasuke and Dai Chan decide to head back out and wait in the car. Gachan stays behind to listen and look for anything strange. Oh. Gachan has been in the dark cave for about... Would you stay in there alone? I wouldn't. 20 minutes when this happens. Hello? Hello? Who's crying? I did? <laughs> 
While sitting in the dark, Kachan is a little freaked out when he suddenly hears what sounds like a woman crying yeah. from somewhere deep within the caves. What? Meanwhile, waiting back in the car, Yasuke and Daichan also experience something terrifying. やっぱなんていうかな。やっぱ寒気。まあ、その洞窟っていうのもあるけど、やっぱそこがすごいよね。そうね。なんか雰囲気が違うもんね、やっぱ。ね。うん。あと、コウモリエグかったね。あ、前
opens by itself. What are you smiling Night at? Night shift worker Veronica explains that she believes that several ghosts haunt the Baylor Hospital, but she says that one of them, the ghost of a young girl, can often be heard laughing and singing throughout the hallways, as if trying to reach out to the staff. So is the hospital haunted by the spirit of a young Maybe. girl? Maybe. Let me know what you think. The mysterious mannequin. Uh, I'm not too convinced by that video. Tell me in comments what you think. This next eerie clip was posted by TikTok user The Truth 444 The video shows a tourist in Paris stopping at the storefront of the famous and very controversial brand Balenciaga. The woman notices something in the store window that is truly disturbing. Okay, people, tell. Why is it a controversial brand? I know Balenciaga. I've heard about that brand before, but why is it controversial? Do you know? Tell me in the comments, because I don't. Tell me something. So this is a store in Paris. This is a man's store in Paris. And this is a, a um, mannequin that they say that they made this and put this in the store. This boy look like somebody dead and bomb. Look at his hand. Wait, I'm doing it through the hole. Look at the boy hands. Look, the hands. I am looking. His hands, his hands is as real as mine. The woman is freaked out by a mannequin that looks just a little bit too real. But things are about to get even weirder. Watch closely. If anybody have this guy missing, please. <laughs> this is crazy. I've never seen anybody look so freaking real. How you have this man in another store sit on? Look. Look at that. You see? This this is freaking crazy. Look at the look in the guy's eye. And them said they made this mannequin. Has his head moved? And put clothes on him and have him sit down in the window. Look at the guy's freaking face. He's in Paris. If you know anyone that missing a black son, look like this. He's in Paris in the store in the window. The mannequin suddenly appears to be looking directly at the woman. Yeah, he has Viewers moved of the his video head. Are creeped out by the sudden change in position, and some even swear they could see the mannequin blinking. The video gets a massive amount of attention as viewers begin to make wild claims that the multi-billion-dollar fashion brand Balenciaga has embalmed one of their models and that the mannequin isn't a mannequin at all but is in fact a missing model by the name of christopher tyler oh that does look like him as well i see now i see why balenciaga might be controversial if that is the case claims become even stronger after christopher tyler seems to drop offline he stops modeling and mysteriously his Instagram account is suddenly set to private. People became so disturbed by the ultra lifelike mannequin's resemblance to model Christopher Tyler that Chris had to actually post an Instagram live addressing that he was safe and actually very much alive. Like I appreciate everybody concerned, but you know, you can't feed into whatever you see on the internet. Nah, you a clone, bro, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a fake page, they told me. He's alive. Everything, everything in the book. In a book. But all of this really doesn't explain why this creepy mannequin seems to stare at this tourist who that gets is too true. close. The hospital visitor. Holy moly. This next creepy video was posted to the internet without a source. It is said that the video was taken by a patient in a hospital in Indonesia. Allegedly, he recorded the video to reassure his friends and family that he's safe and in good hands. But when he looks back at his own footage, he sees something so disturbing that he no longer feels safe at all. A dark figure veiled in black can be seen watching over what? another patient. Now, that on its own is not that scary, but the man recording the video claims that there was no one there at the time. He says that there was no dark... Is that the Grim Reaper standing there? Is the Grim Reaper for real? 
Or is it just another shadow creep? Figure. Now, many viewers of the video have said that the eerie figure appears to be floating and that they believe the apparition might be the Grim Reaper, patiently That's what awaiting I said. the patient's death. But I'll leave that up to you to decide. Thank oh, you dear. so much for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, do it now and then also turn on all notifications so you now. never miss a video. You can also follow me. Thank you all for watching. I'll put up here a playlist and I recommend a video. And right about here, if you click my portrait, you subscribe to the channel. If you decide to do that, comment it down below and I will thank you personally in the comment section. Thank you all for watching. Until next time, bye bye.